guys, welcome to the Barcelona's and to our weekend update. It is international week, so this time we are going to focus mainly on the players who are likely to be involved in the next week against uh, Moldova and Wales. So we are going to start in the Premier League. There's only one place to start there. It's at Goodison Park. Burnley beat Everton 1-0. Jeff Hendrick got the goal. Robbie Brady was involved in the goal as well. And Stephen Ward got the assist, so it's great to see. If you haven't seen it, it's one of the team goals of the year, so it's really worth a look. Um, elsewhere, Rob Elliott and Kieran Clark both played for Newcastle as they drew one all against Liverpool. Shane Duffy featured for Brighton as they lost 2-0 to Arsenal. James McLean came off the bench for West Brom and Shane Long played the full 90 minutes for Southampton as they lost 2-1 to Stoke. And it's good to see Shane Long getting game time for Southampton. Um, in the Championship, David Myler scored a penalty for Hull as they won 6-1. And Aidan McGeady scored for Sunderland against Preston and then did a full out of or around the full length of the pitch to celebrate in front of the home fans against Preston. It's quite unlike Ed McGeady, but uh, yeah, there you go. That's something uh, interesting that happened. Um, elsewhere, Ran Darren Randolph and Cyrus Christie both got booked for Middlesbrough. Both played the full 90. That's something. Uh, John O'Shea played for uh, Sunderland. Eunan O'Kane played. Richard Keogh played. Connor Hearn played. Scott Hogan came off the bench for uh, Aston Villa. And Glenn Whelan also played in that game. Glenn Whelan uh, got a yellow card and cleared the ball off the line in the last minute to ensure that Aston Villa beat Bolton. Um, elsewhere, Shawnee Maguire played and Daryl Horgan came off the bench for Preston. A um, few little t things to pick up on. Harry Arthur missed out completely for Bournemouth. Interesting to see, will he be involved? I don't think he'll be involved in the next week with this injury problem. Kieran Westwood also missed out. I know he's kind of third choice goalkeeper now behind Darren Randolph and Rob Elliott, but he missed out through injury. So will Colin Doyle be the third goalkeeper? We shall wait and see tomorrow or today. Um, interestingly, Wes Hulahan was also left out completely of the Norwich squad. So if he's injured, we don't know. Will he be involved? Is it just that he's not playing quite well um, for Norwich, so we'll have to wait and see what happens. Um, outside of the squad, the only kind of major thing was Adam Rooney, um, who hasn't really been involved, got a hat-trick for Aberdeen, who were probably the second best team in Scotland at the moment. He got a hat-trick there, so that's something. Johnny Hayes also featured for Celtic, as they nearly, nearly got beaten by Hibs, but they didn't. So it is International Week, as I said. We have a lot more tomorrow. We're talking about Declan Rice, um, and then Wednesday we've got a preview of the Moldova game, and then other stuff to come during the week. So um, yeah, so tune, stay tuned, and we shall see you during the week.